This is Master Wong Xun Leung, one of the world's leading authorities on Wing Chun Kung Fu. He is also recognized within the Hong Kong martial arts community as being the late Bruce Lee's foremost instructor under the guidance of Grandmaster Yip Mun. The sequence of simple hand patterns being performed here, although appearing rather gentle and harmless at first glance, are the seeds of an ingenious system of combat containing some of the deadliest close-range fighting techniques ever devised. Wing Chun, based on the principles of both physics and human anatomy, has been proven as one of the most practical forms of self-defense to date. Grandmaster Yip Mun was responsible for Wing Chun's world fame. The text you see here, written by him, is the entire history of this southern Chinese system which he introduced to Hong Kong from his native province, Guangdong. The roots of the art go back to the famed Shaolin Monastery, which for centuries was the hub of Chinese martial arts. During the Qing Dynasty, Manchu troops killed most of the Shaolin warrior monks and burned down their monastery. Among the few survivors was a Buddhist nun, Ng Moi, who took refuge in the White Crane Temple at Tai Leung Mountain. There, according to legend, she created a system of Kung Fu after being inspired by watching a crane and fox in combat. She then taught her deadly art to a woman, Yim Wing Chun, whom the style has been named after. Yip Mun, the fifth generation master who died in 1972, openly propagated what was once a secret style in order to preserve the art from extinction. His disciple, Bruce Lee, credits Wing Chun for being the basis from which his own modern style, Jeet Kune Do, evolved. <laughs> 